Happy Vlogmas! Happy Vlogmas! <laughs> Vlogmas day four. So I'm doing my hair right now and I pretty much never do my hair like this so I thought I would just share. Um, I took a shower, I just blow dried my hair. I love this blow dryer. I bought this back in beauty school and oh we're discovering things in this video. I didn't realize you could take this off and like clean it. Okay it's got like a little ventilated system here that you can take off. Anyway so this is a really good a uh, hair dryer, which I got, like I said, back in beauty school. I've had it now for, what, like three or four years. So it's the Bioionic Whisper Light. So it's quieter, it's lighter. These are great, great hair dryers. So like I said, doing my hair differently, I pretty much never do like standard curls like this. I haven't finished this side yet. I thought I would like show you guys together. So as you know, I've been watching This Is Us, and I like love Mandy Moore's hair. In like the throwbacks and like I low-key want to just like right now just like cut this <laughs> and just have like those really cute like 70s bangs I love those Ooh, I'm gonna resist um, for now like I was gonna share this about washing my hair because it's so different now see I have a hard time curling like down to the bottom because my hair is so like razored and different texture it's all different lengths so it's hard to like get that curl down to the bottom. But, so, I finished Accutane about a month ago, and my, when I was on Accutane, my hair, oh my god, it was so different. My scalp was so dry. I know this sounds kind of gross, but I literally wash my hair maybe every week or 10 days. So, now that I've been off Accutane for a month, the good thing is a lot of those like dry side effects have gone down and I haven't broken out anymore, which is great. So my, my lips are slightly less dry. I did notice though, for that whole Accutane journey, my eyes got so, so dry. It drove me absolutely crazy because I wear contacts. So I'd only be able to wear my contacts for like maybe six hours a day, like max, and I'd have to like plan out my timing with them. So thankfully, since I've been off the Tane, I have slowly gotten my normal like eye moistness back moisture moistness that's not a word yeah I completely forgot to update you guys on that well maybe it's been like a month or just a few weeks I'm really not sure it hasn't been like too long but um it's slowly getting back to normalcy over here not like super dry because I was wondering if I would stay super dry my skin is probably now normal and you know before it used to be so oily like so oily so it's kind of nice that now it's like normal but anyway I'm on here to show you how to like curl your hair I guess I don't normally do this this brand is called Anju Anju A-N-J-O-U I pretty much never use this curler because if I ever curl my hair it's normally with a wand because it's like a completely different look I kind of like twirl. Ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't. <laughs> just kidding. I kind of try to like twirl the end as I do it to be able to get the bottoms in. Because I like that look. That's like when I'm curling my hair, like with an actual curler, I, I like that look of the curl going to the end. And then when I use a wand, it's more of like a beachy wave with the bottom kind of straight and tussled. Like this is a totally different look from what I normally go for. So. Hi, good morning. It's a little life update for you, but I've been trying to put my heat on a lower temperature because I'm just trying to take better care of my hair. It's looking pretty good. It's actually pretty shiny. All thanks. Oh, the way hair oil. I just got another one. I bought it during the sale. I love that hair oil, guys. It's so good. And I also have been using um, just like a ton of keratin products, like protein building products for your hair. So... Today, I'm meeting up with my friend Janelle. She's one of my really good friends. I think you guys know her by now. Uh, we worked at Mac together. She was actually my boss, and like we're super good friends. She also does like um, social media, has an Instagram. I'll link her below. So we're gonna just meet up. We always meet up and like get lunch and catch up, but we're also gonna do like a little photo shoot. We wanna go to like a Christmas tree farm or something and just take some cute pics of each other because that's what you do. <laughs> Girls, we all love to take pictures of each other. 
I always kind of like to like twirl it all together too. I don't even know what I'm doing. Like, I don't even know. I'm probably gonna like tussle this up. I don't know why I had some weird urge to do this today because you guys know I've been wearing my hair straight every day. So it's like, okay, why did Alex feel like doing this today? Well, probably because we were doing a photo shoot actually. I can kind of wear it straight in the middle part for one picture, tussle it for another, I don't know. We're switching it up, vlogmas. Anyway, um, that's that. I'm gonna finish my hair, try to pick out a couple outfits, and then we will go. Okay, so quickly I thought I would show you, like this is the before, this is just like normal curl that we just did, and this is like the after. I'm on my tiptoes, so I thought I would show, I don't know why the camera looks different than it did a few minutes ago. So I thought I'd show you how I just kind of like create that volume over here, like that more like tussled, big hair looks. I have a couple products that I really like. So first, I already went ahead and like hairsprayed it and let the curls like cool down and set with the Nexus Comb Through Finishing Mist. Um, I'll link all this below. This has um, a medium hold. So I just like really let that like set the curl. So then I'm just going to kind of pull the hair apart, kind of just like shake it out a little bit, soften it up, and shake it shake it out shake it out so i use the living proof bodybuilder customizable build and hold bodybuilding finishing spray i like this at the top it literally has like a customizable like top where you can turn it for like high volume or low volume so i do high volume of course and i kind of just lift the hair and it automatically just like pfft, hello lifted and you guys know I also love the Living Proof Full Dry Bo <laughs> Full Dry Volume Blast. I have bought this so many times. I like to spray it on the root and it will really just like lift you up, lift you up. If you want a little bit more on the root, a little bit like bigger. So I think that looks a little bit better. It's kind of like a bombshell, like sexy hair, like ooh, <laughs> I'm a... I'm not gonna say Victoria's Secret model because we don't support them anymore. Subtle shade. Okay, so I'm about to leave. I thought I'd show you guys the sweater I got from ASOS. I just couldn't resist. I'm all about the Christmas spirit. I also love these jeans um, from Nordstrom. I think they're NYDJ. You guys know I'm just like totally obsessed with this straight leg lately. I think they're really cute. They come just about ankle length and they um, flare out like a tiny bit, like a straight leg. I don't know, I really like them. And then I'm wearing this new shirt, which I can't wait to take a picture and I think it's gonna be really cute with like some red lipstick around Christmas trees. Follow me on Instagram if you wanna see it. I also really need to organize my closet. It's really bad. Ooh. Okay guys, Janelle and I, oh, oh it is so bright. so bright. Let's go to the shade. <laughs> oh my Lord. Oh, we're talking <laughs> We are, okay, so Janelle and I, <laughs> Back when we used to work together, it turned into like a thing. We always spoke in British accents. We had to. Because we had to. <laughs> and now we call each other sister. <laughs> like sister. British sister. <laughs> so this is Janelle. Oh, sorry, we're still in the shade. Janelle has an Instagram. I'll link her below. She's like super fashionable and pretty and you should go follow Aww. her. <laughs> we're gonna, we're at like a little tree farm. We're gonna just take like some cute pictures of each other because we both understand the, the struggle of <laughs> Instagram photos. It's real. And Instagram. It's real. Okay, so Janelle and I just took some pictures and now I'm gonna head into the mall. My grandma's getting my aunt some mascara for Christmas and she wants me to pick it up for her, pick something out. So let's go see what we can find. I love this red lip. This is the Fenty Beauty red lip. I love it. All right, mission accomplished. Okay, so I'm home. Guys, I'm obsessed with this gumball thing from the other day. Even Mark last night was like playing with it. I don't know why, it's just like so calming. It's better than a normal stress ball. I will try to find it and link it, but it's also just called the gumball, like for your hands. So hopefully it's on Google or I can find it for you. So from Sephora, as I said, I got my grandma the primer and mascara. And I also picked up a new foundation. Uh, I've used this before and I saw it and it just reminded me of when I loved it. It totally used to be one of my favorite foundations way back when I first worked at Mac because we had a Clinique counter next to ours uh, and my friend at the Clinique counter gave me a sample of it and I love it so it's the Beyond Perfecting Foundation and Concealer 2-in-1 and I'm the shade Linen. I remember that I'm the shade Linen from back when I used it before 
and it's such a good foundation i also feel like the one i have now is slightly the wrong color but i love this foundation and it has like a giant applicator <laughs> Like, look at this. I remember, oh yes, I remember it looks like this. It's just got really nice natural coverage. It's got like kind of a natural finish. So picked that up. I'm going to get a little bit of work done and then I'm actually gonna meet up with Abby for dinner. I haven't seen Abby in a little bit, so I'm excited to catch up with her. And I really want some boba tea, um, some bubble tea, boba tea, is that what you call it? I am obsessed with boba tea i don't know what to call it call it what you want i get the tapioca boba in it um it's so so good and the place that we always go to has it so yes i almost went and got some last night so when she asked me to go there today i'm like okay sister <laughs> happy vlogmas happy vlogmas got our bobs what did you get for your smoothie dear uh, taro avocado with taro taro taro, 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 taro <laughs> avocado can i try it i've never had the avocado Thank you. You don't like the boba fills or pull the straw? I do like the boba. I get boba now. I, I didn't before. And then one day I tried them. I will wipe off my lipstick. You don't like it, huh? No. Like it. She knows me. <laughs> no, like Ab Abby knows me, honestly, probably more than like. Oh, I'm your first friend. She's my first best friend. We met in kindergarten. When I don't like something, she immediately is just like. Nah, you're not going to. <laughs> it's weird because I thought I would like it with the avocado, but I don't. Why is that? It's not as sweet as that one. That's why. <laughs> I'm a child. So I get um, taro milk tea with boba. I really like it. When I first got it, Abby introduced me to pop, strawberry pop, like little bubbles. But now I like boba because it's chewy. <laughs> chewy. <laughs> Abby's the OG rapper of our friend group. Okay, I am home now. I dropped my phone. Oh, goodness. Guess what time it is? Time for more This Is Us and more gumbo. I'm not even mad. I'm not even mad. So, thought I would share a little skincare Sorry, my toilet is making so much noise right now. A uh, little skincare moment, because I've been using this like religiously, and I feel like it's really worked. It's the Glam Glow Flash Mud Brightening Treatment. So I thought I would just chat with you guys while I put it on. Oh God, my hair is so snarly. Like it's just like underneath is just like a big old <laughs> snarl, which I'll work on off camera. <laughs> That's the only issue with my hair getting so much longer. I just feel like it totally Gets so snarly so easily. It's the only thing like I want to cut my hair I'm trying to push through like I really Oh That's it. That's the tea. I really want my hair to get back to like a Super long place. I haven't had it like really long in a while. So these are my favorite makeup wipes by the way I literally buy them like all the time from Target or the Bliss Makeup Melt. I don't know, I've just been buying them like religiously for a minute. Longer than a minute, maybe a, maybe an hour. I just feel like they work really well. Something about them that I enjoy. You know what's so weird? My under eyes have been like low key crusty lately. <laughs> I'm not really sure why. I just feel like they're um kind of, dehydrated or something so I think I'm gonna do like um this after the thirsty mud I got all this stuff during the Nordstrom rack event and I love it I love all of it I feel like it's working super well today might be the day I need a second wipe after that red lipstick I don't like to use two wipes but got a lot going on here today so since I'm done with Accutane. I'm just trying to brighten up any marks I have. And we're slowly but surely getting there. Wow, I had a lot on today, guys. A lot on today. All right, I'm gonna wash my face and dry it and then we'll put on the mask. Okay, so skin is clean. As you can see, my skin is so much better. My face is a little bit red. I'm a little overtired. So with the flash mud, it's got like 
some granules. <laughs> my cheeks get so red when I'm tired. Wow. That's just so sad. <laughs> it's been like that since I was a baby. I've talked about it before. My cheeks get red and hot when I'm overtired. <laughs> and it's like when I take that makeup off, it's like, okay. Whoa. Are you okay? So when you put this on, you need to like rub it in to your dry skin first to start like a pre-exfoliation. And I love this. I feel like it's made such a difference lately. The fact that my skin is super red, you can't really tell, but it's definitely helped with the acne scars and marks. And I have still been using my Derma Flash. I talked about that in a vlog before if I thought it was worth the money. I mean, I already had bought it, so I've been using it, and I do feel like that also helps take off like dead skin, keep me exfoliated. I leave this on for 20 minutes. And I rinse it off. I think this works really well for brightening. And then I'll probably end up doing the thirsty mud after because it's like um, just like a really thick moisturizer kind of. And you can leave it on. Um, after the time is up, you can kind of just like massage the excess into your skin. So I pretty much just do that to keep me super hydrated. Uh, that's what I've been doing a lot lately. And I also have been using the Charlotte Tilbury uh, Magic Cream Moisturizer for the last few days. Since I got it in the PR box, I've been using it morning and night and I really like it. Kind of feels like a sunscreeny smell. Um, reminds me of the beach, but it feels good. So anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna wrap up Vlogmas now. And uh, tomorrow's video is going to be the one of Mark and I doing the Christmas snacks taste test. So it'll be a little bit more interesting. And then I have some super fun things planned for this weekend. So make sure you come back and I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.